Check this out. Wow, the water is so clear. We're sitting in 15 meters of water here and look how clear it is. So it's a late afternoon, I finished work. The wind was kind of light from the northwest. There's a big front coming through later on tonight. So northwesters in front of a big front coming through is always a good sign for snapper. Water this clear is not. But I thought I'd send it anyway, it's a Wednesday night, I've got nothing better to do. So I'm heading out and I'm gonna see if I can't get myself a pink on. There's a big, massive patch of bait here. I can see it, see it all busting up on the surface and there's a few birds on it. So I've got a stick bait rigged up. One of Sam's stick baits, he's homemade. I'm hanging to catch something on it. So I'll have a few casts around here. But this could be where I anchor up tonight because if there's bank bait here, that's always a pretty decent sign. Oh, we're off the back here. We're in 17 meters, sort of. Wow, that's a lot of bait, eh? <laughs> Yeah, bait like this. It's this time of the year. It was exactly the same as this last time of year as well. Around the May, beginning of June, all the bait starts to come, starts to push in onto the back of the reefs. And last year we were getting a few tuna and all sorts of stuff showing up in the Bealy Trail. So awesome. I don't really want to drive right into it. Oh, he's having a crack at my lure. Stupid. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Righto, so there's bait absolutely everywhere, right on the spot that we were hoping to fish. There's a bit going on over here. Yeah. Check out the sounder. That is all just bait, so that is a really good sign. So we're going to fish here. I think you'd be dumb not to, you'd be stupid not to. Um, I don't know, let's get some baits in the water. See what, see what we can come up with. Oh, what was that? Yeah, that's this big. Oh, double hookup, is it? Yeah, I'm in here too. <laughs> Yours sounds better. Yeah. Wow, well, that just came out of nowhere. Oh, hang on. Mine just got bigger too. I think something was chasing that bait. As yeah, well. just suddenly double hookups with a go. But something's chasing that bait there because it's oh, the bait fired up. That doesn't even feel like a snapper though. No, nah, neither does this. Interesting. Oh, I've got line out everywhere here too. <coughs> Just adjust that cam. <laughs> oh, that's what we came for. Double hookup. <laughs> Can't get much better than that. Something had to happen with all this bait around though, yeah. surely. The bait's just been erupting around the boat for the last 10, 15 minutes. Mine actually might be a snapper. Oh, it feels like a decent fish. Like it's pulled a, yours pulled a good bit of line. Yeah, I think mine's a snapper. Mine got yours is different, I think. <laughs> Yours got angry. Mine like. got reasonably angry about halfway through there. Mine feels quite light, doesn't feel too heavy. I'm giving mine another half a turn there because I'm getting into this one now. Oh. Oh, they're both going hey. I don't feel like these are snapper, eh? Oh, I can feel something in there. They're definitely oh, slow. In my line. Oh, here comes oh. yours. I'll try and move it over this side. <laughs> That was crazy how they just both hit at the same time, but hey. There's something in the line going. <laughs> I had that happen to me last time. You know what I think it is? I think it gets caught in their fins. That's a snapper, I can yeah, see it. Snapper. And it's a good one too. Oh, he's a good fish, man. Oh. You're netting on your own too. Because I'm slugging away here. Yeah. Oh, he's a real good fish. Can you just be careful not to slap the net on the side of the boat too much? Yeah. Oh, I don't feel like this one's a snapper, eh? Oh. oh, it is, and it's a beast of a snapper. Yours another snapper. Yeah, it's another good one. I'm struggling to even get this up, but I'm on, I'm on the heavy outfit here too. Oh. Yeah, the boys. Oh, surely that's a double, a double hookup. Oh, yours is another good one. Oh, oh look at him. Hang on. Oh, you seen the thumbnail here? Because I am. Yes, sir. Oh my God, <laughs> yes, the boys. They're huge. You. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Dad. 
Look at that! Oh, he's a beauty. All right, let's quickly. Wow. Oh, he's too big. I don't want him or wow. him. They're both too big. They're both. Wow. wow. All oh right, my God. let's quickly sort this out. I'm going to stick a tag in this guy quickly and we'll tag them both. Hang on, I'll set a camera angle so you can get a Figure it out, yeah, we got to get a thumbnail with both. Four two. Wow, he fought hard, eh? He's. Yeah, how big is it? Uh, 82. 83. 83? Yeah. So there you go. Two fish, they're both a pigeon pair, 83 centimetres each. We just put a tag in both of them. <laughs> I've tagged mine and tagged Lee's, and these two can both go back. Oh, yours is jizzing everywhere. We're going to put them back right now. Hey, ready? Woo! Head cam rolling? Yeah. Hey, right. Yeah. Just swim yeah. it first. Oh, yours is gone. Oh, gone. One's not so happy about it. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, he's getting kicking. He's kicking. Come on, buddy. Now's your chance. Follow your mate down. You're too big for us to eat. Oh, yeah, he's gone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> that was pretty epic. Snapper fishing. Yeah, it's not that hard. <laughs> the mystery of not showing the fish is kind of cool, too, I feel. Oh, you're in again. That was pretty sneaky. Oh, I dropped it. Oh, that was so sneaky. I saw it going like this. It was a real gentle take. I think that I could have just left it. You know what it is? Is this? I put a circle hook on that one. Oh. I've never been a fan of circle hooks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but they're supposed to hook themselves on a circle. -y. Look, this is the exact situation where circles are meant to excel, and I've never had any luck with them, eh? Oh, the bait's still on everything. That was annoying. Wow. Well, yeah. Another snapper was a snapper bait for sure. Just like that, it's over. We got two snip offs by a shark. It suddenly got a little bit dark, and the bait just gone. Like the whole time we were here, we can hear the bait working, we could hear it splashing and splashing, and then suddenly it just stopped, and everything's gone dead, so the bait's moved off. Interesting to note is both times we got fish, there was bait around, but both times that the fish hit, um, there was big concentrations of bait that came through. The first one, there was a big concentration came through this side. Bam, we got a double hook up. The second one that Lee hooked and dropped, there was another big concentration that came through this side and he hooked up almost straight away. So that shows you that the fish are following the main schools of bait. There's a lot of it hanging around and it's scattered, but there's main balls of it. And it seems to me like the snapper are following that along. Anyway, the bait seems to have moved on. So we're gonna get out of here. It's a school night. We've had our fun. We've tagged two fish for research. Um, as you could probably see, I don't know if you can see or not on the video, Lee's fish was jizzing all over the place anyway, spawning. A, those big ones don't taste great, and when they're spawning, they don't taste great either. And to me, it's kind of counterproductive um, killing spawning fish because that's the future of our fishery. So putting those back just makes plain sense to me. We've had our fun. Like I said on the way out, a nor'wester, all bets are off. When there's a nor'west wind blowing before a big front, you always know it's going to be on. Even though the water was crystal clear, I was pretty confident the fish were going to be on tonight. And when, as soon as we saw that bait, it was just a no-brainer. We knew we were going to catch something. So we've had our fun. We didn't bring home a fish to keep, but those two fish were just too big. And like I said, they were both in spawning mode, so not ones you keep anyway. If you like our videos, stay tuned. Hopefully the next episode will be after this big blow comes through the next few days. Maybe Saturday I'll get out with Jack and we'll be back into it. Thanks for watching.